I don't care if you like motorcycles or whatever. If you care about beautiful scenery, you're gonna like this, this video with the sunset. Thank you, God, for times like this, for allowing me to see things like this and do things like this. It's all right, guys. It ain't nothing but a Zippers Performance bike with some Chrome Works exhaust. I don't understand people that buy touring bikes but never go touring. It went from fun to not fun. It's <laughs> just that quick. Mental is brought to you by Custom Dynamics, Zippers Performance, Chrome Works, Redline Oil, Volunteer Audio, and Let's Roll. We about to ride, we about to ride. It's that time of year again. Traveling Talls Run to the Hills 3. We are ready. And I can't wait to have you guys down to Knoxville, Tennessee. We are going to ride. We are going to ride. The host hotel will be the Hilton Garden Inn in Knoxville, Tennessee, 6200 Paper Mill Drive. Click the link below in the description to get a discounted rate. The banquet is on Saturday night and tickets will be on sale to the banquet. Of course, we're gonna have t-shirts provided and a giveaway for those who attend the banquet. We only have 130 tickets that we can sell. Last year, they sold out quickly. This year, I'm expecting it to do the same. I'll be giving you some more details on the ride that'll be coming up, so you make sure that you hit that subscribe button and turn on all notifications to be notified so you can receive up to the minute information about the rides that we're going to be riding at Traveling Tall Friends of Hills 3. Guys, I hope to see you there. Don't forget, mark your calendar for June 9th, 10th, and 11th for Traveling Tall Friends of Hills 3. Last year we had a blast. This year is going to be even better. Like, share, and subscribe. Keep gliding. And as always, have a blessed day. Where'd I put my wallet? Hey, thank you, man. Oh, that was the uh, highest toll to go over the bridge. $14 a piece. I don't think I paid anything the last time I went over this bridge. But that was like two years ago during the height of COVID. And I don't believe they had workers there or something. I don't know what they were doing. Right here, what you see to the right is the Chesapeake Bay. That beautiful sun peeking through there. And what's in front of me is the long, long bridge. You have the scenic overlook, but we're just going to go and ride over it and under it or through it. And that's awesome. On the other side is Norfolk. And we may stop there for tonight. Let me close this down so you can hear me. It's something when you can't see the other side of the bridge. Where you can't see the land on the other side. I'm not talking about this part. I'm talking about when we get to the main part. What do you think, Tess? <laughs> yes, it is. Yeah. Come on up here, let me get let me record you. I'm gonna come on on my right side here. Let's get you in the shot too. <laughs> Just get in the other lane over there. It's fine, ain't nobody going. So guys, that's Tez back there. We're cruising on Highway 13. I will tell you, this 13, it's a pretty awesome highway so far. I, I like riding down this road. You see, go through a little little bitty towns in Virginia, uh, little towns in Maryland, just rural towns. Something to look at every now and then, you know? Instead of going down the interstate, just blazing past everything. Look at the sunset. It's like we picked the perfect time. By the time we get to the other side, the sun will probably be completely down. 
And the thing is, they built two of these bridges, not just one, two. They said they had uh, built one. Okay, so I was told that they built this bridge, then the son built the second bridge, helped on the second bridge. So that was pretty cool, father and son effort. Wow, look at this. <laughs> this is awesome. This is awesome. Guys, I'm going to let the GoPro just run right here. The sun's going down. Thank you, God. It's amazing. Thank you, God. For times like this, for allowing me to see things like this and do things like this. So there's some people parked over there on that bridge. I don't know what they're doing. I guess they're doing construction. It's it's windy. I haven't even paid attention to the speed. Oh, it's not 70. <laughs> it's 55. Oh, and there's the police right there. So let's see. Let's slow it down a little bit. I'm glad I did that. Let's just en enjoy it. Yeah, I thought I was, I, hey, I was just running, man. I wasn't, you know, paying attention. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Man, let me show y'all that bridge over there. Look at that so, for a second. Check that out. Look at it, guys. This is really cool. Come on up a little closer, Ted, so they can see your side profile of your bike there. I'm about to lock my cruise control right here. Is that another bike up there? No way. It does look like it, but there wasn't a bike in front of us. I don't remember seeing one either. Yep. <laughs> There's Tez on that big, big Ultra. <laughs> this is fun, guys. This is what I'm talking about, getting out riding these things. I don't understand people that buy touring bikes but never go touring. You can't say because it's built for this or built for that or whatever. You could, it's a built bike that I'm riding. Now, I know there's some people that love stereo stuff and they they uh, put speakers in the saddlebags and this and that or whatever. But have two sets of saddlebags and use them when you go riding the other set for luggage. Or just throw a bag on the back like he did, which he's much better than packing than I am because he got all his clothes in that bag and I got clothes all over the place. <laughs> Man, this is cool. This is cool. That's some more police lights. Let's slow it down a little bit. Left lane ends in one mile. Okay, I'm coming over. Man, it was $14 for a motorcycle. I wonder how much would it be for like a camper or something. Yeah. See that, that boat way out in the distance? That's crazy. Would you be out here in the boat like a little boat? <laughs> okay. Well, we would hope you wouldn't have to put your swimming skills to use, but I wouldn't want to be out here in a little boat, but a cruise ship is fine. But a little boat, not so much. Looking at those waves. Yeah. Yeah. All right, guys, now this is called the Bay Bridge Tunnel. You remember? So we are on the bridge. There gotta be a tunnel. There's a tunnel. And guess what? Yeah, it is. And guess what? I'm about to let these chrome works bark going through that tunnel. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. We out here having a good time on these glides. That's what it's about. 
That's what it's about. Okay, there's brake lights. Come on, people. And there's uh, police lights. What's he doing? Oh, he's just probably telling us to, you know, I don't know what he's doing. Oh, he got somebody pulled over. Yeah. All right, we're entering the tunnel now. Okay, ooh, ooh. <laughs> oh boy, that thing's sounding good. Man, I better stop that before I spring a leak in these walls with them chrome works barking like that. <laughs> oh man, I might create some kind of uh, underwater earthquake. It's all right, guys. It ain't nothing but a zippers performance bike with some Chrome Works exhaust. Woo! That's what I'm talking about. They lucky I ain't doing that all the way through the tunnel. <laughs> I hear that ultra back there making some noise too. Yep, he got chrome works on there too, guys. All right, we're almost out. Oh, it's really loud towards the end of the tunnel. You think that's it, right? That's not it. We're back on the bridge again. Still going. I think the whole bridge is like 14 miles long. The whole thing. Oh man, look. Sun's still up. Let me turn this around for you guys can see that. Beautiful. Beautiful sunset right there. Over the Chesapeake Bay. I don't care if you like motorcycles or whatever. If you care about beautiful scenery, you're gonna like this this video with the sunset. Man. You can see the city way, way out there. Way over there. You there's not a chance you're gonna see that on the GoPro. Look how long it is. I, I like to ride. It'd be cool to ride a bike on this. They should make a bike lane somewhere where you could ride a bicycle. It'd take you forever. So we are now 20 miles away from Norfolk, Virginia. Not far from Virginia Beach. Not far from, uh, there's like Hampton, Norfolk, like several cities close to each other. As soon as we get off of this. Yeah, I just saw that sign, it said emergency pull off it. Oh, slow down. Okay, said I was going 64. All right, I'll slow down. Emergency pull off right there. So like if you're having car problems, you can pull off. Ooh, that'd be a nightmare though if a car broke down or something broke down had this bridge backed up I don't know where there's another bridge that you know that's you're miles away from crossing if you look at the maps if you guys pull up Google Earth and you see it you are miles away um, from any other way of crossing this saved so much time when people were going from that part of Virginia to this part of Virginia. Beforehand, they had to go around a long ways. So road work ahead. Which lane is closed? This one? We'll get in this one here. That's something when you could 
make one, dedicate one entire video to a bridge crossing. Lane in, merge right. Okay, so we merge right. Not on land yet. It's another tunnel. See that boat right there? What's crazy is that boat is going to go over top of us. We're going, we're riding a motorcycle under the boat. That's crazy if you think about it. He's going just right over there. I don't know how deep we go in the water. But it has to be pretty. Okay, they didn't, they didn't change it up. Yeah, oh, we're going on oncoming traffic. We on one side. Yeah, don't care for this too much. Do not pass in a tunnel. Oh, I'm not going to pass. You ain't got to worry about that. Oh, man, there's brake lights and people. Nah, man, I ain't trying to get stopped in no tunnel now. That is not... That's not the plan. <laughs> that's nothing that I want to do. And they are, I see brake lights. Y'all better get up out of here. No, no. And that tractor trailer looked like the, looked like the top of that trailer was like very close. What y'all doing up here? I, yeah, it don't. And I, I, I'll just slow down a little bit so I can keep rolling. Ain't nobody trying to spend no time under the ocean in a tunnel. It went from fun to not fun. <laughs> Just that quick. They're moving. Why is it so dark? Where's the lights? Oh, it must be a tractor trailer. He looked like he's skimming the top of the other thing. Oh, we're almost out. Yeah, good. No, you don't. All right, I'm having fun again now. I can see the light. I can see the light. Oh man, maybe that ain't the light. Maybe that just a light and not the, oh, that's outside. Okay, I can see the light. We good, we good. Long as I can see the other end, I'm good. Man, yeah, he didn't have room at all. Very close. We're almost on land. Yeah. Yeah, so that's where the boats went right over us. What was that? Oh, okay. Yeah, I forgot that's your thing. You know, you know about all that technical stuff, right? <laughs> Tess was talking about the converter system that they got for the construction. If you like construction or, or, you know, the way, if you like, if you're fascinated by the way things are put together, that's definitely something to look at. And we are almost off of it. Almost there. Almost on solid ground again something in the road go to the left oh a dead bird
sun went down. Sun's almost touching. Almost going down. That's absolutely beautiful. Let me show you that again. And that's why I ride and that's why I travel. To see things that you can't see. Well, you can see them. You guys are seeing them like on the channel. But guys, I promise you, get out here and try it for yourself. You'll love it. And most is like what? What'd you say? Yeah, this is living. This is living. Seeing something that you haven't seen before, doing something that you haven't done before. Being here as awesome as it could be on the video. Being here in person, living it, doing it, feeling it, feeling this breeze riding on this motorcycle. It's it's amazing. It's amazing. Like I said, I feel I, God has been good to me, and I'm grateful, and I thank Him for opportunities like this. That sun, by the time I get there, it looks like that sun is going to be splashing in the ocean, going to be done. Perfect end, perfect end to a great video going through the tunnel. I'm going to couple this video with the other videos to traveling, but I'm going to put this tunnel video, I, I probably had put this by itself. So guys, I want to let y'all know that if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you'd like to see more like it, please subscribe. More videos coming soon from this road trip. Tall and Tez touring on them glides. I don't know what the title can be. It be something. Who knows? But anyway, like, share, subscribe. We touch down on the uh, on the ground now. Like, share, and subscribe. Keep gliding, and as always, have a blessed day.